Hi guys, it's Adam, and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how we can export a 3D model object from Blender to Unity uh, without having an issue with uh, rotation uh, that most of, in most cases when you're trying uh, to export an object from Blender to Unity you're gonna find out that um, the Unity will have a different rotation it's gonna be either 270 or minus 90 uh, degrees which is ni minus 90 and 270 is exactly the same value um, if you are actually you know working on a very uh, basic object and you don't have an animation or you, you're not planning to add any script to this um, object inside the unity uh, that's fine but if you are trying to create a script let's say we want to rotate our uh, object on the y axis or z axis uh, what you're gonna find out is that for uh, z axis will be y axis in unity other way around and that will cause uh, an issue okay so to show you what I mean by saying that we're gonna have an issue with the rotation I'm going to export this object that I created before simply three cubes uh, I added a UV as well so we are going to find out that we, we in unity we want to have exactly the same uh, layout as in blender file export Autodesk FBX that's the correct path let's just call it cube FBX um, make sure that we have the same default values so restore defaults and we are going to export only selected object scale 1 is ok, leave the default values and export now go back to unity and we have cube and by default as you can see the um the up is not up actually so i'm going to just drag and drop the object it's very small so we are going to change the scale factor by clicking the cube object and say to one and apply okay so as you can see everything looks fine but rotation is minus 90 degrees so I have second cube remove this one so if you have a static object um, it's perfect I mean you don't have to really worry about it um, because you know if you're going to put the object somewhere and play the game you can see that this is a static object there's no there's no animation there's no uh, scripts attached to this object so it's perfectly fine but let's find out what's gonna happen uh, if I'm going to add a script that rotates this object on the Y axis and you can just simply drag and drop it on the on the cube and we have rotator and by default if you if I open the rotator I'm planning to rotate this object by 5 degrees every second on the y axis so x is 0 y is my rotate speed which is 5 multiply time to delta time which means regardless of how many frames per second I have on the scene uh, it will always be one second and z value 0 so let's play the game or scene and this is exactly not what we are we, we are expecting to see uh, we were expecting to see this object rotating on the Y. Uh, what I want to show you as well, um, so we, we have a global value here, so sorry, global uh, rotation axis. So by default in Unity, global, uh, the green arrow is Y, the red one is X, and the blue one is Z. So if I switch to local, as you can see the local means that's the aces on the cube object and as you can see they are completely different so you can see that there's a 90 uh, minus 90 degrees uh, difference so if I just say 0 actually matches uh, so local axis matches the global axis so if I play it once again it rotates as we expect it to be so it's perfect almost but um, so as you can see it looks okay rotation looks fine 
but we have another problem we have a problem with a u is not on the top so our up face is not over here um, so that's the one of the reason why i decided to um, you know create a um, instead of creating a simple cube without an uh, without an um, textures wouldn't be you, you wouldn't be able to see uh, what what have we done here but now obviously we have some issue here we have to go back to blender and the best way to do oh you might find a better way but actually that works good for me so change the rotation to minus 90 degrees and now we have to apply this rotation so press ctrl a rotation and now export the object once again so autodex select object exactly the same as before cube export fbx so voila now we have rotation 0 0 0 we have the texture is facing good direction once we play the scene we can see that the object is rotating on a good scale so thanks for watching and see you next time